Well, I'm back with another round of stories making headlines in Uganda today. But before that, you know, I must remind you to subscribe to the Buzz UG in case you haven't and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. My name is Melads Milo, aka Fuller. Well, starting off with uh, Teddy Bujingo. Uh, Teddy Bujingo has advised all people who are planning to go back to school to first make enough research about that institution or that university that you plan to join before making that move. Her advice comes after the National Council for Higher Education announced that Pastor Bujingo's newly acquired bachelor's degree is fake. According to Kaiwa International University, uh, Pastor Bujingo graduated with a bachelor's degree in theology and integrated studies. Chirunge, <laughs> Wakirizibwa atene echo kubiri chogendo okusoma ogenda kutu kiliza butu kiliza kugamba bagamenti baku tikida oba chosoma chiri muomu la mua echo chie nsonge nku na ye nga wicho mu tikida nzimbade simanyi tiba mu tikida na ye mkama mruonji bwa nga wa mu tikida well, there you go. That is uh, Teddy Bujingwa speaking about this whole issue of acquiring a fake bachelor's degree. And this issue has been trending so big time on social media. And definitely we had to listen to what Pastor Teddy Bujingwa had to say about this issue. Well, in other news, you guys, you remember some time back, former Kampala RCC, that is uh, Mr. Hudu Sain, was accused of uh, snatching another man's wife. Uh, that is the woman in the picture right there and uh, she's called Shamim Namusisi. Uh, actually, she went ahead and uh, introduced Mr. Hudusen to her parents in a secret introduction. Now, the latest sad news is that her ex-husband right there, Mr. Sewanyana Lamek Ibrahim, has died. However, we haven't really confirmed the cause of death, but according to reports, uh, some people are saying that he had a blood clot. It's very sad. Yes, it's very, very sad. May his soul rest in peace. Well, in other news, uh, last month, lawyer identified as Gawaya Tegule. Yes, Gawaya Tegule. Very, very strange name right there. I don't know the meaning of Gawaya. I don't know the meaning of Tegule. I don't know which tribe this guy is. But last month, uh, Tegule dragged President Museveni's son, Jeno Mohozi Kainerugaba, to court for allegedly making presidential declarations through the birthday parties that he had recently. Uh, Tegule, in his petition, said the acts of Jeno Mohozi Kainerugaba were political and partisan in nature aimed at promoting the Chwezi dynasty and yet Muhozi is still a serving army officer who is not supposed to be political or even partisan according to the constitution of Uganda. Now, the latest news about this story is that Jeno Muhozi Kanerugaba has asked the constitutional court to dismiss this petition because the 48th birthday parties doesn't contravene the constitution of Uganda. Uh, secondly, Jeno Mohozi Kanerugaba says the petition was filed before a wrong court since it doesn't require a constitutional interpretation. So, court is about to respond to Jeno Mohozi Kanerugaba's plea and I'll keep you posted right here on the Buzz UG. Oh yes, those are some of the stories that are making headlines right now on different social media platforms. And uh, in case you haven't subscribed, kindly subscribe and also tap on the bell for all the notifications. And trust me, I'm still gathering more stories right here for you. My name is uh, Melads Milo, aka Fuller. Thank you. <laughs>